Here are five effective ways to lift your spirits and turn a bad or boring mood into a more positive one in the morning, afternoon, or evening. Number 1. Exercise is important. Getting some exercise, whether you go for a run in the woods or go to the gym to pump iron, is one of the most effective ways to add energy and a more positive outlook to your daily routine. Personally, I prefer free weights most of the time because I can do them at home and because they give me an energy boost along with a nice boost of testosterone. That boost sharpens my focus and lifts my spirits every time. The interesting thing is that sometimes just a few minutes of exercise will be enough to lift your spirits. You could, for example, attempt 60 sit-ups. This micro-workout usually alters my mood. Number 2. Just go ahead and do it. If you're having trouble doing something, getting started, or changing your mood using the suggestions above, just do what you need to do regardless. You are not your feelings and thoughts. They aren't your bosses or parents, for example. You are not obligated to obey them. Your thoughts and emotions are being observed by you. You pay attention to them on occasion. And sometimes you just think of them as blabbering in your head and body. Then you simply leave. You're free to do whatever you want. If you simply take action and complete it as soon as possible, your mood will improve. Number 3. Listen to or watch motivational videos. This is one of the best ways to start your day, in my opinion. Rather than reading the newspaper and being bombarded with negative news and world views, watch or listen to one of your favorite personal development products. Reading is also effective, but listening and seeing provides a more three-dimensional experience, allowing for the inclusion of the always important body language and voice tonality, as well as adding emotional power to the information. The audio version of the 4-hour workweek, just about any tape with Brian Tracy, or watching a video by Eckhart Tolle are some of my current favorites. I just consume one of those sources for 15 to 20 minutes if I'm feeling down. Not only has my mood improved since then, I'm also constantly reminded of a useful tip that I can apply to better my life. Number 4. Physiologically alter yourself. Your mood will change if you change how you move and use your body. For example, if you want to feel happier, force a smile for 60 seconds. You'll be happier as a result. Stand up and confidently walk around for a few minutes if you want to feel more confident, slowly, head held high, posture relaxed, but not slumped. You'll have more self-assurance. These things can be done for specific effects. However, combining everything at once is a better way to use your physiology to change your mood. While walking around in a confident and relaxed manner, smile. To get the best effect, put everything in there. Focusing on your body and changing your movements is important, but turning your focus outward, into the world around you, is also important. This has recently provided me with more reliable and consistent results. Number 5. Find joy in it. Possibly the most ludicrous suggestion of the bunch. Complaining and being a little negative about everything is often seen as cool or funny. Isn't it cool to go around appreciating everything? But, in general, I believe that almost everyone admires and finds a positive person to be appealing. And simply developing a habit of appreciating more is a very effective way to become a more positive person and to enjoy your life more.